Our top story this lunchtime, South Korea's employment figures for October are down compared to the same period the previous year. It's the eighth month in a row of on-year decline and the drop in October was the sharpest in six months. Kim Sung-min starts us off. The COVID-19 pandemic continues to leave its mark on South Korea's jobs market, with October seeing the sharpest on-year drop in employment in six months. According to data from Statistics Korea on Wednesday, the number of people in employment last month was around 27 million, down some 421,000 on year. This marks the sharpest decline since April. The figure has been on a downward trend for eight months in a row, which is the longest period of decline since 2009. South Korea's employment in October has shown a declining trend after being affected by the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic, especially following the resurgence of the virus in August. The rate of employment for those aged between 15 and 64 was around 66 percent in October, down 1.4 percentage points on year. The manufacturing sector was hit hardest compared to the same period last year, which could be attributed to the decline in exports in October. But the impact was less pronounced in the education and retail sectors due to the easing of social distancing rules. After the release of the report, the finance minister Hong Nam-gi said on Facebook that the government is unaware of the current situation and will pursue various measures to stabilize the job market. Kim Sung-min, Arirang News.